Welcome back to 10 Slide Info, a channel which brings you the latest info on defense and aviation in a clear and concise way. In a noteworthy development, the Indian Army is evaluating an air-launched variant of the Martlet missile, also called the lightweight multi-role missile, for its fleet of light combat helicopters. This move could significantly strengthen India's rotary wing strike capabilities, especially in high-altitude theaters such as the line of actual control. Earlier this year, India signed a 350 million pounds, about 468 million US dollars government-to-government procurement agreement with the United Kingdom to acquire Thales ground-launched Martlet missiles. Under this deal, the Indian Army will receive thousands of Martlet missiles, and these include configurations for shoulder-fired launchers, vehicle-mounted launchers, and very short-range air defense role. The lightweight multi-role missile is lightweight, around 13 kilograms, and capable of Mach 1.5 speeds, with a range of 6 to 8 kilometers, and laser beam riding guidance for precision. Currently, the light combat helicopter is already equipped with a 20 mm cannon, 70 mm rockets, and in some cases Helena anti-tank guided missiles. However, integrating the Martlet missile would address a gap, providing a light, precision-guided munition, that is more agile than heavier anti-tank guided missiles, and more accurate than unguided rockets. According to the source report, the Army could issue an RFI by mid-2026. If this goes ahead, the acquisition could form a key part of the Army's modernization. The Indian Army's interest in an air-launched Martlet variant, for its light combat helicopter fleet, signals a strategic push to enhance its high-altitude and counter UAV strike capabilities. If successfully integrated, this lightweight missile could significantly increase the lethality and adaptability of the light combat helicopter, especially in challenging terrains like the Himalayas. Thank you for joining us on 10 Slide Info. If you found this video informative, please consider liking and subscribing to our channel for more content on defense and aviation. Thank you.